plan for to go, saying I couldn't go show, so I was like, all right then. And then, like, someone dropped out from the school trip, and the teacher rang my mum and was like, oh, it'd be really beneficial if Melissa went to the clothes show. Mm-hmm. And then I just ended up going, and, like, loads of different agencies were like, oh, do you want to be a model? Do you want to be a model? And all me and my mates were just like, what the hell? Like, I could not be a model. Do you know what I mean? We were just like, leave, it, leave us alone. I just want to go shopping. Do you know what I mean? And it was like getting harassed all day, and then all the agencies called back, and we just went up to London one day, and just, like, went to see Select and that, and then I just got signed. So it was all like some massive, like, I wasn't even meant to be going to the show, do you know what I mean? So it was all just like a massive fix, wasn't it? <laughs> you, you went down there simply just to, to have a look at the fashions, to, to, know, uh, yeah, to like, uh-huh. get makeup, just like have a girly shop and that, and ended up like getting scouted with Slay. And so. people just kept stopping you, so, yeah. Yeah, all day, like, do you want to be a model? Can I take a picture? It was just like, what the hell? But me and all my mates were just like, Melissa, you could not be a model. Like, literally, we were just like, Mel, why do they keep asking you? You can't be a model. <laughs> It's <laughs> like all the agencies calling, but we just went with select. I don't know why. I think it's because they give her like free travel, you know, like on the journey, or they give her like a free transport to come down. So we're like, oh, we'll just try them, and then we'll just like just went with them. It was so weird though, because we just didn't understand anything. So yeah, I still did school. This is her, her side, yeah? Yeah, but yeah. I was quite naughty, so I was just like didn't really go. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> <laughs> but my mum came with us till I was 16, you know, like, chaperoned us and that. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And, like, we went to Paris together, me and my mum, we went to New York together. And then when I was, like, 16, so, like, we're just like, oh, you're old enough to do it on your own. So I just started doing it on my own. And then, like, I went to South Africa on my own, New York on my own. Just spent time in loads of different countries and that, and it was really good. Really good. like travelling. That's, like, the best bit of it all, the travelling and just the money. I just save all my money. Mm-hmm. That's one thing I'm good at. <laughs> 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 it's like, what was it like? I mean, you hear so many rumours, don't you, about, you know, being a model, doing the catwalks, etc. It's glamorous. People think it's glamorous, but it's hard way. Mm-hmm. Like, it's definitely glamorous. You can see the glamorous side of it, your hair and your makeup, travelling around the world, but it's hard way. It's such hard way. People, that's, that's what people don't get. I think people just think you get everything handed to you. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I mean? But you don't. You have to, like, work hard at it. You have to, like, be the person to get the job. Do you know what I mean? You have to look 100% perfect on a custom. Do you know what I mean, though? There's so much competition out there, so yeah. every job that you get, it's kind of like, wow, I'm getting that job, do you know what I mean? You yeah. have to, like, there's so many girls in the industry, and you just have to be, like, just bang on it, do you know what I mean? To make sure you keep getting booked for jobs. And how do you keep yourself? I mean, do, do you have, like, a, a beauty regime, a fitness regime? I mean, are, are you one of those lucky ones who you can eat what you like? Yeah, I'm you? lucky. Like, seriously, I've been to the gym twice. I just can't hack it. It's just like... <laughs> <laughs> I be the gym once for my mum and then I was my friend Erin and I literally I just die. It's just like it just doesn't motivate me at all going to the gym. I just can't do it. <laughs> and have and you have, have you have you sort of met any of like, like like you know the biggie biggies? You know have you met you know the likes of the Naomi's or whatever? Um, I went with like trying to think. I've seen Paris Hilton before to show. Mm-hmm. Um, I went with Giorgio Armani. I did his catwalk. That was amazing meeting him. Like, I think he's he's the biggest that I've worked for, Giorgio Armani.